Oh, excuse me. That's right. You were looking at a pile of crap. Um, that's what that was. It came from this car here. Yes, sir. Um, Poochman here. Uh, if you've been following me on Poochman Motors, uh, I was closed for a few days because of remodeling. And um, let me show you the pictures, the P4 pictures. Um, I, something happened to me. Uh, rather profound. Uh, profound. Uh, uh, as you know, I work. Um, I don't want to say I work slow, but I work slow. Uh, it takes me forever to do stuff because I don't know, half the time I don't know what I'm doing. So, yeah. All right, once again, I'm not prepared. I don't have the pictures. Anyway, so, there we go. All right. So, you remember the wall. So, this is... This is where I normally sit, right? And then this is my little film bench, and this is my workbench. Well, the wall that used to be over there, you know, by the doorway, right? Um, it was a complete disaster. Complete. And then my camera's not going to work right now. My quality never, quality never. Okay, here we go. So, this was the wall. You can't really, well, you can't really tell. But anyway, the, the, um, it was this pink color. And there was, like, these giant holes that were busted into it. And it was, it was a mess. I've lived in this house for 30 years. And I just finally got around to fixing this wall. So... I, I mean, I've been working like gangbusters on this thing. I wanted to build this rack for my jammers. And um, so I created this rack. It holds like 95 jammers. And um, it's six foot wide and 82 inches tall. And it, it, it came out really sweet. And I came within a half inch of clearance. Because <laughs> I didn't calculate for drywall and everything else. So it was really... It was really a close call, but I pulled it off. So here it is. The new and improved Poochman Motors. Library O Hot Wheels. So I was able to, today, Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to all you guys, by the way. Uh, today I was able to sand the joints, texture, and paint, and assemble this whole thing in like three and a half hours. So, my uh, OCD, once again, triumphed over my ADD. And then there's the uh, fulfillment center there for our Poochman Motors. And I'll probably be going through all these cars here and, like, weeding out some stuff. Uh, so, yeah, I've been working on that. That's been my project for the last week. And uh, now i got to work on this doorway here. Um, this door opens out, which is kind of funky. But because of the garage, the old garage door that was there, um, that's the way it had to be because all the hinge and everything. But I want to, I'm going to rig this door up so that it, it opens in, inward. But I have to fix this, this jam here. So I've been, I've been furring out drywall and everything. So when the time comes, I could just cover it over. But yeah, I got to create a jam, and then flip the door around. I kind of like the door. It's got a little. It's got a little window with a little trap. Uh, little trap. Door, trap. So when I hear crazy stuff at night, I can peek out and then not be totally obvious. Yeah, whatever. Okay. And then so a little update on the front yard. You guys remember? I don't know. A year ago or whatever, I was working on my front yard. I got finally got the water main in. And um, so I'm trying to figure out what to do with the front yard. So here it is, the pooch man's front yard. Um, no more grass. Uh, no more plants in the ground. Everything's going to be in pots. Well, you know what? The, the rose bushes are going to be in the ground via tires. 
big low pro 30 inch low pro tires so let's take a walk through uh, my my Frankenstein garden uh, I don't know what the neighbors think and I don't care and I'm still kind of I'm not sure how I think how I think about it but I'm just gonna run with it and hopefully it'll turn out okay so here let's walk through the front yard of the pooch man's crazy castle so this is sort of like tiered right so this this one right here will be like a step it'll have like decomposed granite right and then this one here will be filled with 30 inch tires and then rose bushes I've got one in a pot over there. the other ones I don't think I'm gonna be able to salvage but we have to put all new rose bushes in and then this another walkway here so there'll be DG here and then um, another planter there so these will all have like succulents in pots or whatever and then this will be like rock half inch like gold rock California gold and then that'll be California gold and then this will be a just the DG and then the rest of the front yard will be DG right and then um, and then I have to put in my irrigation system which is over here I already got it all roughed in so then I just got to run my uh, run my peeps over uh, underneath all underneath all these little gizmos here and these are actually bleachers these are bleachers I got somebody had some scrap metal and um, they were gonna, they wanted me to just come pick up the scrap metal but I decided to use them for my uh, planner project so free crap so anyway yeah these rose bushes probably are gonna get killed because I'm gonna the string represents the porch the new porch so it's gonna be concrete all the way across to the wall and then I'm gonna blow this uh, roof little porch roof out it's gonna go all the way across the house so I have a big old porch all the way across which should be pretty cool I put these rocks and stepping stones in here but uh, I ain't feeling it and I'll do something different with it oh there goes my crazy chicken chicken time chicken time anyway so yeah that's it so uh, I've been tinkering a little bit with Hot Wheels here and there I found, well this I got this all cleaned off because it was filled with jammers so it's all so I could start working on that get that all dusted and cleaned up and organized and whatnot uh, I got a list of more cars on Pooch Man Motors if you're not if you're not checking me I go to Pooch Man Motors on Facebook and uh, I've been selling tons and tons of cars doubles and extras and and stuff I'm not interested in anymore so go have a look there uh, be sure I might be posting some stuff tonight so have a look at that uh, you also catch me on Instagram uh, do all my latest wheel swap craziness on Instagram so if you want to go there check that out um, I was gonna do something uh, oh I found this the other day in my junk pile I was gonna scrap it the matchbox taxi um, I don't know why I took that off. That was whack. And I took off the I took off the little New York um, taxi scene thing and the little price banner that was on there. And I think I'm gonna turn that into a gasser. What do you think? Checker gasser? I don't think I've seen one. Yeah. I do that. Uh, been stocking up on uh, monoblocks. Uh, I got monoblocks, monoblocks, monoblocks. Uh, I love the monoblocks. Get some monoblocks and do some do some swapping. Um, I guess that's it. Pretty much it. Yeah. So, anyway, happy Father's Day once again to you guys, and uh, I'll catch you later on the next video. I'll have I'll do some kind of crazy Hot Wheel thing. I know you guys hate it when I don't do Hot Wheel stuff. Well, some of you guys like well, anyway, whatever. All right. Uh, tip of the day. Uh, when you fly the American flag like that, if you can see it, always salute. Because if you don't, you know what happens with that.